This is if they know, isn't it? Watch that. 20 past 11. Right, so we're heading into spring now, so it's the time of year when we start thinking about summer bedding plants. So what I'm going to do this morning is I'm going to pot these small geraniums on into a larger pot so they can grow on and get a bit sturdier ready for summer. So we're not going to put these outside because it's far too cold at the minute, but we are going to pot them on and then leave them in the greenhouse. If you're going to pot on a little plug plant like this, don't use too big a pot. All it'll do is it won't take up all the nutrients, it won't take up all the moisture, so it might sit in a in wet compost. Just a small pot, so you can see, you're not going to waste too much compost as well. Give the, give the plant a chance to, to develop before you then pot on from this size onto that. So you're talking probably in another three or four weeks, you'll be potting on again. A couple of other little bits of kit. I've got a, a little dibber that I'm going to use to make the holes in the compost. I've also got a, an old blunt nail that I'm going to punch the small plug plants out with. These have been sat in water, so they've had a good water in this morning. A good quality peat-free compost. Fill the pot and just tap it down. Just make a hole in the middle, just like that, with the nail. Just going to tease that plant out. And then with the leaf, just going to lift the, the little plug out. So you can see you've got a nice little root system. I'm not going to touch the roots and I'm not going to touch the stem of the plant. All I'm going to do is use the leaf. So it's just a matter of popping that in there and then just gently push it in. And we're going to use a, a product called Rootwell, which will, will help the roots develop. It's got mycorrhizal fungi in it and beneficial bacteria to promote healthy root, root growth. Once you've done all your plants, give them a good watering again, just to settle the, the compost around the plant and let them drain. The thing to remember is, because of the temperature that we're at at the minute, keep them in a, in a greenhouse or on a windowsill. And we're gonna get some frost next week in this part of the country. So I'll probably be covering them over. Just use a little bit of this fleece, just, just cover the whole thing, the, the whole of the plants over. So you've got 20 plugs there. That would probably be about the same price as buying one mature plant. You've got 20 for the price of one or two maybe. And it's just a matter of potting them on and sitting them in your, in your greenhouse or on a, a warmish windowsill for a couple of months. 